So you want to know how to copy trade multiple prop firms on one platform. That's been a question that's been asked multiple times in my comments. JC, how are you trading multiple prop firms on one platform? How are you doing this copy trading? I didn't know you that you can copy trade Top Step, Apex, Fast Track at the same time. Listen, uh, it took me a while to figure this out. Uh, but there is a way to do it with Quantower. I don't know if you can do it with other platforms. With Quantower, which is the platform that I use, you can. So I'll show you today how to set up your Quantower, what features you have to pay for to be able to copy trade multiple platforms, and how to set up your copy trader. All right, so first step is go to the Quantower site, download the actual program, um i listen i'm on pc i've always been a pc guy when it comes to trading i think mac has advantages in other worlds for trading no uh get familiar with windows get familiar with pc that's the way to trade all right so quant tower download it, install it that's going to take you right here to the platform that you see me trading every single day um as you can see up here this is what um you see um every day trading prop firms let me actually delete one of these because i was doing it as an exercise but i'm going to do this live so let me delete this one so i can show you guys how to do it all right cool so as you can see i have top step fast track tape profit bull knocks apex these are all rhythmic accounts so step one when you open up an account with a plat with a prop firm make sure it's a rhythmic account trade of eight has its own platform i do not like trade of eight the copy trade feature does not have um, stop losses and take profit. You have to manually set it afterwards versus being able to enter on a position with a stop loss and a take profit and is very finicky with group trading or copy trading. You can't set a master uh, stop loss or take profit. You have to do it manually. I do not like trade rate for that reason. It's only because I copy trade, number one, multiple prop firms and multiple accounts at the same time. I find Quantower is a killer when it comes to that. I do not have any issues with copy trading with Quantower. I can't tell you how robust this platform is. Um, anyways, I'm not here to sell Quantower. I'm here to show you how to set up Quantower for multi-platform trading and multi-account trading uh, on different platforms. So first step is make sure you have an account created with Quantower. You have to create your own account. You got to log in and you have to be able to buy a certain package. So if you hover here and you click on this icon, you will see that I am paying for advanced features. That is the only extension you need. Um, you're going to click on open store, boom, and let's get out of here. When you click on open store, it's going to take you to the website under pricing, right? You're going to see this all in one license for 70 bucks. You don't need it. I mean, if you want to pay for it, go ahead. You got to throw your money around. Uh, you got that. Go ahead. But you don't need it. If you are truly just needing the ability to connect multiple platforms and copy trade, you're good to go. All you need to do is scroll down and pay for the required features only, right? Again, you don't need to pay for this license. You do need to pay for advanced features. And that is right here. Advanced features for 30 bucks. That's it. That's all you need to pay. Uh, advanced features if you take a look at it it tells you simultaneous connections okay and with simultaneous connections you have the ability to connect to multiple platforms at the same time and that's all you need it's 30 bucks let me go back to my previous screen right there it's 30 bucks and you can buy it make sure you're logged in set it up your account once you pay for it close Quantower restart town quant tower and now you have advanced features available okay so uh and of course if you want to open or buy or for other packages you're more than welcome to take a look at all those packages let's go back to quant tower so now you've paid for the advanced features now you have the ability to create multiple connections simultaneous connections as you can see up here so i've already created one let's create a new one so for instance, I told you guys that you have to set up, ah, I don't want to set, I don't want to show my IDs. 
All right, let's go back to which one can I use? Dun, 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 dun. All right, I guess I am going to have to show my ID somehow. All right, I'll blur it. All right, so um, first step is make sure you open a rhythmic account with the prop firm that you choose, whether it's Top Step, Take Profit, Fast Track Trading, Bullnox. You can only select rhythmic if you want to use Quantower. Okay. As you can see, I've selected multiple connections. In this case, Rhythmic is up here because I've already added it as a favorite. Normally, you will find it down here. You select Rhythmic and you're good to go. In this case, we're going to create a new account, right? New account. This is going to be JC's Prop Firm. And I'm going to enter my password, which is JC Prop Firm, blah, 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 blah. Okay. And connect. Obviously, it's not going to connect in this case, uh, but that is the step. Assuming you enter the right username and password, um, you'll be able to connect to that prop firm right then and there and add it to your list of prop firms, right? While that's go doing the whole disconnecting thing, why don't you guys smash that like, smash that subscribe button, help me in my futures trading journey here on YouTube uh, by liking, by subscribing. You're telling YouTube that you like my content and YouTube will start spreading my videos and sharing my videos, uh, recommending my videos on their platform. Uh, that's my goal. I've mentioned it multiple times. I'm building my community here on YouTube. So help me out in the meantime, hit that like and subscribe button. All right. So as you can see, it did not connect. That's fine. We expected that I'm making it up. Uh, but now I want to rename this and I'm going to rename it JC's prop firm save bingo. And I'm going to star it. Let's favorite it. So it shows up on top. Now, every time I'm connected, I will know which prop firms are connected, which ones are not. And depending on how I set up my copy trade, right, uh, those will show up, which leads me to the next one. Let me make sure I can set up my copy trade the way I want without disclosing too many account numbers. All right, here we go. So um now let's go so i think that's clear you've set up all your prop firms you're good to go now you got to set up your copy trading right so first step right here this icon you're going to look for copy trading that's going to pull up your copy trading menu as you can see i have i have plenty already created based on different trading styles if i want to trade all my props i'll run this one if I want to trade my Grand Prix uh, with Fast Track, if I want to trade my Daytonas, um, and the way I have these set up is uh, Grand Prix will trade with Apex, FTT Daytonas will trade with Apex, and I have Daytonas and one G Grand one Grand Prix that I'm trading a little differently with more size. Um, but anyways, for this scenario, we're going to use Top Step. We're going to use um, the account. 7240 let me check that it is the one set up right so this is the account we're using it's a 150k account with top step and i'm going to set up the copy trade so uh you would come to create right in this case i've already created it and i'm going to click on settings so the first thing i'm going to give it a name top step only or let's say it's going to be top step and bull knocks. Okay. I'm going to create, I'm going to set up, which is my leading account, which is the master account that's going to copy trade the rest. So you need to know, make sure that whatever is your leader, right? You are using that account afterwards in terms of where you place your orders, which is the account you're placing orders. And I'll go over that. So in this case, 7240 is my leader with top step. I'm going to add right here. Since uh, I already have accounts uh, in the pro in the system, I can simply add three, four, and five, and it gives me all the accounts. However, if I want to change an account, I can simply select it here, uh, click the arrow key, and then select it. Now you're going to tell the copier, well, how many contracts do you want me to copy? So for instance, if this is your master and you're entering one contract, do you want it to do the same thing? In other words, one contract. 
in some cases um, where I have a account or accounts that I want to use more leverage, I'll come here and put two, which means if I enter an order for one contract here, all of these will have one contract in my copy trade and the last one will enter with two. That applies to your entry and to your exit. So it's literally copy trading. All you have to do in your mind is cop is trade one account. You you are only trading this account right here. That's it. The rest Quan Tower does based on the copy trade that you set, select or the the, the uh, number of contracts you want set up in your copy trade. Okay, so we're gonna save that. Uh, let me just make sure it did save. Yes, we're good to go. And um, so now I just said I just selected all of the accounts for top step. But you know what? I want to trade bull knocks as well. Okay. So there it is. I can add another account. Okay. Well, in this case, these are duplicates. I only have one. And let's say the second account I wanted to copy trade it to. So in other words, you have a master top step account. You have your top step copiers at all at one. One top step account is going to trade two contracts. Uh, and then my bull knocks one contract and then two contracts. You let the system know how you want to enter. Maybe you have a 300K account with somebody else with another prop firm. And you want that account to go in and out with three contracts every time you enter here with one contract. Now, this is a multiplier. So for instance, if you decide to go in with two contracts on your master, all of these will go in with two. This one will go with four contracts, right? And this one will go in with six contracts. Be very careful, that's a multiplier, right? So one contract here, it's easy, one times one, one times two, and one times three. Two contracts you open on this master account, you're multiplying that two by the multiplier. 2 times 1, 2 times 2, and 2 times 3. So careful. You save that, and you're good to go. And then you simply run it, right? Now, make sure that your leader is set up. In this case, now I'm done here. My leader, I can tell, is here. And in my trading, uh, in my actual enter orders or, or buy orders or sell, uh, I have that account selected. Anytime I enter, whether it's one contract, two contracts, whatever it is here, remember you're copy trading based on the multiplier that you selected. So it's important to make sure you are focused, you understand what you're doing. Now, I mentioned that the advantage of copy trading on Quantower, I can set my stop loss. Let's say I'm giving NQ some space and I only want to give it 20 points. 20 times 4, that's 80. I usually do a point or two. Um, I'm sorry. Let's see, I wanted to go for 20 points. That's 80 ticks. I usually give it a point or two to cover the commission fees. So 82 ticks, right? That's 20 points. 20 times 4, right? Every point in a NQ contract has 4 ticks. So you're doing it based on ticks. Uh, and a take profit. Let's say I'm going after 40, or lately my popular one is 50 points. 50 points, again, times 4 ticks per point. That's 50 times 4, which is 20 or 200 ticks. Okay, so you're good to go. So now when you enter, you will have your stop loss set at 20 points and your take profit at 50 points. Does that make sense? <laughs> uh, I'm not going to do this live. No, I'm not going to uh, blow my accounts just for the video. Uh, but that is the advantage. You have a stop loss and a take profit that you can set on entry. This is what Trade of 8 does not allow when you're copy trading. And you can do this on Trade of 8 when you're trading one account not multiple or not even multiple prop firms. You can't trade multiple prop firms on trade of it. All right, I'm going to turn this off so I don't screw up later. And we are good to go. That is how you set up Quantower to trade multiple platforms and how to set up your copy trading on multiple accounts. Pretty easy, 
So again, the key to all of this is you do have to pay a monthly fee. No, you don't have to pay that all-in-one license, but you do have to pay the advanced feature option on their website for 30 bucks a month. All right, guys, hit that like, hit that subscribe button. Join me in my futures trading journey here on YouTube. Help me with the YouTube algo. Help me get recommended by YouTube out there on the web and slowly grow my community account. If you have any questions, hit me up in the comments. I hope I made this pretty easy peasy because it is and it should be. Have a good one, guys.